Welcome back, Arsler. We're here. Welcome back to episode number 42 of our legendary Mortal Empire Skaven campaign. Clan Rictus, Stretchy McCraven Trails. Let's move any character to the. Oh, yeah, we've seen that in the last episode, didn't we? A uh, cup of coffee episode two, please, boys. Ah, I'm going to have to melt. Mm. Somebody please translate that for me. I have no idea what that actually means. Right. I need to move a dude into there. Our other army is almost done. It's going to be a strong army. So I want to send that dude. Oh, he's kind of already going. No, I want to kill that, right? I don't know where that dude thinks he's going to go. So we need to try and kill him off. And if I can get that. I mean, these guys are probably going to try and take that. So I don't know if I want to put that in there or not. But whatever. We did lose our other army that was over here, right? So be a little bit careful. I was, was I bringing my other army back? Or was that last? That was last episode. Yeah, I need to bring a dude up into there, that's what I need to do. Uh, I'm probably just going to grab a guy. Because it can be any character, so. He'll be fine. We'll stick him on assassination. Uh, actually, put him on assault units, because my god, that does a lot of damage. And we can get assassinated too. Okay, that's fine. Right, so we'll send him down to there. I assume this is for Trechi's, um weapon or whatever. Which is kind of sad, we haven't got it yet, 290 turns into the campaign. Ah, uh, that's right. So we want to try and kill this, right? Yeah. Try. We're going to lightning strike it, of course. Lightning strike, ambush, we should be fine. Here's our ambush. Oh, I don't even need to lightning strike it. Um, do we want to auto it or do we want to play it? What's the map? If it's very tree, I think an auto is going to be better. It's not massively tree -y, is it? I think we can fight that. Try and limit the amount of damage we take, because obviously there is another army, like, right there. So we obviously don't want to die to that. Uh, but we will need to kill off his big stuff, of course, with our artillery. Probably focus on those two units of care first, just because they're fast moving, and then go for the big guys after that. Because those big diners are not fast, those ones. They're only like 35 speed or something like that from memory. These guys are fast though. So let's try and get rid of those if we can. That'd be nice. Man, cold today. It's like September for us in New Zealand is spring, right? It's snowing today. <laughs> Can't even believe it. Freaking snowing. God damn. In spring, right? Where's this cave there? So even up on this hill might be a good place for us. Yeah, it's going to give us a good line of sight with this artillery. So we'll bring them in that way. These guys are going to come in behind that. Of course, bomb, artil uh, bomb infantry and stuff. So that's anti-large. Now let's put them in like eight. Doesn't matter what number we put them in specifically. We'll just try and get rid of them like that. Let's do not have Vanguard for everybody. Uh, just in case the cav does manage to get past, I'm going to put these guys in their own group. Just back here to protect the artillery. And these guys come in behind here. They can just shoot whatever. Uh, the Lord's this guy. I need to make sure I put him with these guys. And then these guys obviously in there with those dudes. Oh, I think that's us. Uh, this guy... It's kind of a shame he can't hide. Right. Let's get those guys forward and out of the way. Same with these guys. Right, you... Th oh, that's going to be annoying. You three, I need you to shoot them. You pop your spell. Buff all that up. Get him out of that group. Thank you. It's fine. Push that infantry forward just a little bit. The whole infantry, please. Just there. That's fine. Not getting a lot of damage done on that cavalry, are we? Please don't move forward. Just lock yourselves into position. If you can't shoot them, just shoot something else. These guys are too far away. Oh, come on, this. Oh, that was a good hit. That was a real good hit. They're so clustered up in there, man. We should just destroy that. Come on. Yep, good hit with that artillery. Try and bomb into this big cluster if we can. Thank you, because that is our tomb guard. Is tomb guard? What are they called? Temple guard, thank you. 
Right, you two shoot that one. You shoot that one. Continue on. I'm trying need to kill these guys a bit faster. Yep, bombing temple guard, that's awesome. Very strong infantry, of course, Lizamin. But it should not matter. Uh, so that's our anti infantry. Let's get that set up. And these two are anti large. But that's all but dead, so let's retarget the stuff in. And some of this other big stuff. So these guys here can take care of that. Why are you all so funny group like that? Shoot that dude. Any storm vermin up. Guard mode and such. Bring this guy up there as well. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, put that on the law, there's probably no point. Yeah, that dude got killed, nice. I just want to bring these back in. Just to bomb the stuff if they could. Right, let me attack into there. You guys attack into there. I've still got spells and stuff to do too. Bombs away. It's only on flies with that fly over there. Yeah, that's fine. You always shoot that big dude. Oh, they just melted that. One of those. One of those. Yeah, you get up in here too, man. And then you two retarget on that big dude that's attacking my lord. My caster lord. Get him back in here. Don't let him run behind us. Where's my uh, thing? There. He needs to get in. That's the summoned in ones. That's fine. Uh, took, a, took a little bit of damage. Nothing too amazing. Shoot that with those guys. I haven't actually charged with my infantry yet, have I? No. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, Lord's still alive too. That's Mr. Munde as well. Let's smash him. Smash him, boys. Right, you go chase down people. Remember, because of the stupid ambush thing, that these guys won't actually be destroyed because I fought the ambush. I want to kill Mr. Munde, though, if I can. Uh, not artillery, though, please. If we can, it's going to be a hard target. Come on, Trichy, why are you so slow? Oh, we're not going to catch him, are we? Don't think we're going to catch him. Oh, maybe. Let's do this. We hit him with that. That's a good idea. Although he possibly just comes straight back. Yeah, damn it, didn't get him. Right, how much did we lose? For 99, that's okay. That is okay to take out Mr. Mundi's army. You're fine with that, eh? I'm not going to attack the other army, I'm going to run away. But we need to get rid of this so he can't double team us. Because I don't think I can take two of those armies. Not with the huge amount of dinos and stuff. Although they barely got any kills. Taking out that cave was a good option though, I think. We'll try and stop their speed if we can. Give my artillery more, and my range dudes more time to shoot. Yeah, I remember. I remember our Scaven campaign. That's that was our issue with um, Lizardmen. This is just so fast, and they just get on top of you so quick. Our artillery just never had a time to actually do enough damage, you know. So they just got overrun. We just couldn't stop them. Although I think I went more that heavy than these guys. It's getting these guys in just for having a tanky unit in the front line is a good option. Thank you boys for suggesting. Oh no, we did manage to wipe it out. Nice, that's good, that's good. Uh, we're going to be fine, but we're going to back off into our own territory. Thank you. Can you now regen on? Defeated Mazda Mundi, leadership aura size plus 25%. And we're rich at the moment too. Let's get that up. And let's get one of those up too, please. That other army is... Yeah, one turn away still. That's fine. He's staying there. You, sir. Continue to harass these guys. Set yes, 
yes. He doesn't do as much damage to them as what he was doing to Master Mundi's army, eh? For whatever reason. Uh, just keep buffing him up, I suppose. And that's us. Yep. It's me, dude, that dude. He's already moved, right? I don't know if I should attack this or plague that or plague that. Because I have a feeling the, um, our Dark Elf allies are going to attack that, whether I tell them to or not. So I don't know if that's a good idea for me to attack it. Or plague it. So I'm just going to move my mic. Just hopefully it doesn't make a horrible sound. There we go. I don't think it made any difference. But <laughs> I'd rather have a mic pointing at me than just to the side. Thank you very much. I'll see if we can get a fast wheel going on here as well. No. Anyway, the issue is, these guys just own so much, there's just so much stuff going on over that side of the world, it's so hard for us to actually um, hit the fast forward on that. Yeah, I was talking to my sister who lives, um, how far? 400k away, I guess? It's about right, I think it's a bit further than that, to the south of where I am, we're pretty far south. So she's, she's a lot further south, it's like a five hour drive. So yeah, be about four, four hundred something k's anyway, and she's saying that that today snowfall that they got is the worst amount of snow they've had this season, as in clean winter and stuff. Oh my god, there's so many. Well, I'm glad I'm getting a strong army, but I don't even think that army's strong enough. Although these guys haven't moved yet, have they? No. Come on, don't run away. Attack. It's kind of silly, like, you go into spring and it starts snowing. <laughs> that wasn't that bad during winter. Winter was actually really mild for us this year. Like, it was still cold, but it wasn't, like, freezing, freezing cold. And we didn't have any, like, real big storms or anything either. It was really unusual for us. It's probably going to indicate it's going to be a horrible summer. We had one, like, a summer, like, three years ago, I guess, maybe four, where it just never got warm at all. It was, like, always just overcast and cloudy and stuff like that and just never, ever got warm. It was ridiculous. I'm going to hit this, because I can. And I can get it this turn, I mean. Hopefully the plague jumps to that dude. Oh, can I not? Uh, I might just get it next turn. Right, my army's good to go. Um, but obviously I don't want to be pushing into this stuff. It looks like they're going that way as well. If I go bang... Head that way to try and defend it. I don't want to lose this stuff again. Uh, dude is probably ready to move to. We're back at full health, no doubt. That's a long way down. Good lord, look at all those lords there. Ready to kill, kill. I can't attack this, it's too strong. Even with him doing this type of thing. Unlock the gates. Yes, yes. I need him to come out. Let's see if he's brave enough to come out and fight us one on one. We'll start raiding that again. See if he is. I doubt it. I'm not. That's why I didn't attack him because if he's uh, injured or whatever, he probably won't attack out. But if I can get him back to full health, he may be brave enough to give it a crack. Actually, sorry. Might as well take that. Uh, the plague will spread next turn by itself. That dude's not moving. Uh, that guy's already set up to move. Yes, yeah, so he's going to move down into this region here, which should be awesome. That's us. Can't do much, can we? Yeah, so that guy will move. I don't even know what quest or what um, weapon Tretch uses. I guess he's using some sort of hooky type device, right? Just because that's what he has in like the cinematic stuff. It's not a hook, but it's a hooky type. I don't know what you call it. A hooky type weapon, right? For hooking and stuff. Pulling people in or something. Seems very similar to that. Oh, I can't remember the name of it. It's going to sound terrible. That um, that rat dude in um, God, what's the game called? Vermitide. Thank you. That's the game. That rat thing that comes in a vermitide and like hooks one of your dudes and like tries to drag him away. That's what I kind of imagine Tritch's weapon is, but it's not. But if, that's what I kind of imagine. I can't remember what the name of the unit is that does it. I think it's actually called a hook rat. Now that I think about it, it is, right? It's called a hook rat. Oh my god. Such an original name. <laughs> it is actually called a hook rat. Because uh, he's got a hook and he's a rat. Yep. 
Makes sense. <laughs> oh man. Games Workshop. They're so creative. So creative. And the gutter runner is oh he's not a runner, is he? No, but he uses a, a Gatling gun. Oh, you're gonna be brave. You are gonna be brave, although you didn't attack us, weirdly enough. What's he assassinated my caster? Are you kidding? Critically failed, failed, but assassinated. Damn it. Oh no, that's not that's that's not one way out of here, is it? Negative, I don't think. I think that's the one that was over there. I think. I'm not 100 percent sure actually. My actual dude to spread the plague, I think this was that guy. Yes, because it's over there. Rude. Do you not want plagues? Ah, oh, see now their ships have changed because they can see me. Yeah, right, cool. So you guys are going for that dude? Yeah, okay. Tell him get up there because then I won't be able to stop him. Ah, uh, yep. No. Am I in my normal um, ambushy stance? Yep. Come on. Ambush, ambush, ambush. Of the deep Back soon. My I, I do actually see that it's in our favour anyway, but I'd rather it be an ambush more. You're really not going to let me ambush this dude, come on. It doesn't use up your movement doing this. So. Oh, it actually does. And we're down like a quarter from all these attempts. Right, we'll do two more and then I'll just kill it. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I wanted. Nice. Kill it off. Right, and we'll go back and we'll regen for a turn. Oh, I should go just there's probably fine. Mm, just go all the way back. Doesn't make any difference whatsoever. Okay. Stay there and you can continue to assassinate in here, this garrison. Or assault the garrison. Success, thank you. So, in theory, by next turn, we should be pretty much good to go. I can't see like how much health and stuff they've got, eh? No. We should be good to take that out next turn. I hope. Uh, not moving. Right, get down here and we'll see what the next part of this is. Force Anvil, nice. Win the following battle. So what do we get? 10% uh, physical resist, 15% chance to ambush, and we get an ability which gives us 33% damage resistance and 24% speed, and plus 15 thing for Trichy. Mm -hmm. I assume that's a fairly easy win, so we'll hold off on that. Uh, we could also get another army, I guess. That might not be a bad option. Up in here. Well, oh, it is a high level garrison. What about in here? We'd have time to get it up? Maybe. Something that's. Level 10, yeah, right. For the 13! Right, give me a couple of. Well, give me four of those. We don't want this to be top tier, but I want it decent. Ish. One of those. That's, that's a start. What are these? A turn? Two, say 300 bucks. It's 1200. So it's like 1400 bucks there. Okay. So this guy's really just protecting against these three for now. That um, Plague Priest dude will come back anyway. Um, actually, will he? According to that, he's gone. He's not wounded or anything. He must have. Oh, he was killed, killed. Damn, that sucks. So much for spreading the plague. Bugger. Usually you don't get killed killed because we've had him before when he gets assassinated, right? He usually just dies off a little bit. Well, then he comes back and he's fine. It's just a flesh wound. <laughs> it's one of those dudes, right? 
Right. Still need to get a fast forward on this thing. No, not pause. I'm assuming at some stage that whole thing's going to be vampires. I'm really surprised the Von Carstones and the vampires, like the actual vampires, haven't confederated. I'm pretty sure they can. I'm pretty sure you can confederate that. So I'm surprised that they haven't, although I don't think either of them has been in any sort of danger of being killed off or anything like that, so maybe that's why. Or maybe it's very similar to, like, Greenskins and Norskin and stuff, where they only really confederate when one of them's weak. I mean, I guess that's kind of the same across all factions, right? Usually two strong factions don't confederate together. Even though sometimes they should. Oh, I totally didn't see that dude there. It's not a particularly strong garrison either, I don't believe. Now if I let him just take that, because I want this... What else is it going to kill in that meantime? Is it worth it? Maybe. Maybe. Probably not. Talk to these guys too. The, um... Yeah, because they took that. The Elizabeth really don't have a lot left, do they? Right, what's the position on their other armies? All still there. God damn. So many of them. Look at them all. Just a train of them. Right, let's look at a little bit of money. This army's not going to win anything by itself. Um, but it can at least support our main army, right? Oh, I really don't want to group those, but I need stuff I can get in one turn. Yeah. Try and help that dude out. I want to do something with this guy, but Ridiculous. if I go out there, he's just getting killed off. I've got to fight these things on land. I right, have a look at this army. It's not that great, eh? A garrison. That's stead. So you could probably take both of those, but it's probably worth me taking this right now, right? Failed. Okay. Let's see how strong it is. Hasn't really been hurt at all, way. Eh? Okay, uh, I don't think we can... I don't think we have many problems killing this. Battle fight. Get going. Continue that siege. I don't want them to get another army up here and defend it again. Uh, I don't really want to buff... Ugh, do we? Okay, whatever. I don't really want to buff up his melee stats. Not because I don't want to give him melee stats, just because there's kind of no point. But nothing else up here has... Oh, this region here has garrisons, this one here doesn't. That's annoying. This dude does, obviously. Uh, income... Uh, public order is actually fine because he's got public order there. Come and might as well grab that. My plans came. Absolutely. See, but if I move him over here, he's gonna get these guys are gonna kill him. Oh, so stupid. Five armies, okay. Look at those dark house men, come on. Feel my power. Did all their armies get wiped out? They must have, eh? I think these are all really hurt though. I need to see how strong that one is. Oh, that one's almost dead. So is that one. Can any chance? Oh, I can't even make it. Are you kidding? Ah, oh, would have been so good to take them both out. I just can't quite make it. I could probably kill off that other dude as well, eh? The one we sent down to Anvil Place. Yeah, I could probably kill him off. There's no real point having him alive, is there? At this point. I don't think so. I just don't think so. Right, let's fast forward if we can. Thank you. That's going to die here in a minute, even the Von Carstens. Right, 
Right. Man, I can't believe how much or how annoying the um, high offs have been this whole campaign. It's ridiculous. It's kind of the same for the um, Aletha Nar campaign too, though, right? Because that's the only other one we've really done over this side. Yeah, we ended up dying. It was, it was the yeah, it was the high offs who ended up killing us. I'm pretty sure. No, it doesn't make sense. I can't remember actually. Somebody killed us. I can't remember who it was. All right, they've all backed off. That's oh, except for one. It's kind of what we want to have happen because I want to be able to use that other army. Somebody gained fortunate, so I guess they were trying to assassinate him. Didn't work out. I think we can take that settlement easily enough, right? I mean, it's got to be a decent battle, but I'm pretty sure we can take it. Problem is, of course, the artillery gets a uh, limited effect. Let's call it stupid siege battles. Are these damn dwarfs again? We're just not going to be friendly with you, sir. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. Right, let's see what we're like. I want to try and get another um, garrison thingy done, if we can. Assassination thingy. Right, where's his army's gone? There's one there. There's one there. Can I move out and have a look-see? Can't see anybody. Just going to leave that one there. He may push us. I assume she's going for that, right? Which is a really good garrison, so I'm not that concerned. If you want to come over and give us a hand, that'll be awesome. Because if she goes for this, I think we can win this fight. There's uh, some better troops in this one. Oh, well, says he needs better troops and he recruits slaves. <laughs> I know, but you know. Uh, actually, I've probably got enough anti that. I'm conscious of my money as well. I don't mind going to negative, but I'd rather not. Alright, so I want to do this. Oh, can I not even do that? No, okay, we'll kill that dude then. Thanks. Alright, how are we looking? Do we want to wait for towers? Uh, I don't think Lizardmen. I mean, I don't really need that, do I? I don't think Lizardmen range stuff is that concerning for us. I think we just roll this, honestly. Although it's going to be hard to take out that big stuff without being able to shoot them with my artillery. What's he got? He's got the um, Carnosaur, three Croxies, and two Stegodons. Okay. I assume his stuff that he's going to put on the walls is basically dead, which is going to be basically that slot there. I guess I just have to use my Lords to kill this stuff, which is going to be fun. Our Lords are not exactly the best Lords in the world, are they? Right. How come we can vanguard this time? We couldn't vanguard last time. Rude. No, no, just drop it. We don't even need you on it, man. Right, so these guys need to lead the way because they've obviously got shields. These dudes in behind. Get on board. These guys over here. Why are you guys in that group? Just get in number one. Ah, uh, number two, sorry. Thank you. Right, you really need to set that up like we did last time, eh? So you want those dudes in the front, those dudes in behind, because they have to lob, so it's fine. And this dude goes in there. Just leave him out of it though. And those guys. Why have I got these in one? That's what's annoying me, isn't it? Screwing me all up. You're getting the forest for a little bit of, bit of protection for now, please, sir. Right. Okay. <laughs> that was a lot of damage. Right, go boys. No, the whole unit. I mean, the whole group, please. Not just one dude. Right, these guys get up. Come on, artillery. Frickin' shoot, my god. Shoot that wall, everybody. <sighs> oh, 
it's almost forty percent damage on one volley. <laughs> oh, it's nuts. Uh, pop your thing too. That's it. That's it. Don't climb the wall over here, boys. I get that wall down in a second. Down she goes. No, no. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You guys shoot that. Why is this dude off his thing? All his things got destroyed. Rude. In here, boys. We oh, can cast it out there. Nice. Alright, you guys start shooting, please. Their um, their towers do a lot of damage, don't they? A lot of damage. All my lords and stuff are in. Yeah, watch out for those big dudes. Dude, that guy's taking a lot of damage this season. Get in there, boys. I'm gonna need some support. This is not actually going that amazingly well, is it? My right, Tretchy's in there. Buffs. Get some of these guys out. I'm just basically spamming out units as best I can. Try and kill this stuff off. Well, he's doing actually a lot of damage to that lord there. Can we shoot into these guys or nah? Cute. Oh, they, we're in the gate too. Oh, I didn't realise that. Pop that. This old Tritchy there is. Kill that caster if we can. Right, you get out my caster, please. Should hopefully destroy most of that. Maybe not. Yeah, come on, Tritchy. I don't have enough stuff over here to kill this large stuff, eh? Can you guys come over here? Please? Can you artillery please stop bombing me? I'll get that dude out, because he's just being annoying. I can't shoot with him. Yeah, that's what we needed. My anti-large freaking range dudes. Thank you. Although Tritchy is doing some good work in there. It's hurting a lot though. Right, shoot him. Shoot that. Right, get you in here if you can. Shoot these guys. Right, can you guys come back in please? Yeah, they are, um, I didn't realise their towers were so strong. God. Ah, uh, can we just shoot them then? Because they're right there. Oh, you have one. You boys. Push up into there. We're taking so much damage. God, I hate sieges. Kill that. This goes in, you in. Do you manage to kill off that dino? Nope, this one's still there. Go, Tritchy. If you can't, actually, you need to kill that caster. If you can, kill him first. Yeah, that hurt. Man. It's not going swimmingly, is it? Right, we killed that dude, that's good. Right, kill this guy. You get up there and kill that guy, because that's what's shooting us. Oh, 
God damn, I hate Arturians. I need to fix it, eh? Which is annoying. Oh, come on, Trichy. Let's pick guy, please. Thank you. Come on, you guys shoot him, that'd be awesome. How's my infantry going over here? Not very well at all. Oh, god damn it, I forgot this dude. Yeah, that guy's gonna go down eventually. Totally forgot that dude. Come on, bring that big guy down. You get up there, please, because that uh, thing is kicking our butt. Come on, Trichy, you're a tank. Come on, do well. You guys back in here? Man, I've taken so much damage. That's it. Kill him, because that dude was shooting us for so long. He's still got a bit of stuff left, too. It's not over and done with, this for sure. I can't get a run up in here with this guy. You, you guys are shooting that, right? Oh, it's one of those then. You serious? He's coming back. Kill him. Right, see if we can get that dude down. Man, I've lost so much stuff. Yeah, come on, Trichy. Man, I don't know if I can actually win this or not. I'm gonna have like. Tr oh, God, I've still got him. I'm gonna have like Trich left in my artillery cruise. Oh, get off those goddamn towers, would you? Can you get up there, please? Right, you guys back in here too, not you though. You, you should be there shooting. I don't understand why you're not. It shouldn't really hit us and it didn't. Good. Trish is still at full health. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a tank. Right, here comes this other dude, finally. Suppose we can get him involved, right? Yeah, nice, thanks. Right, here you guys shooting. Yeah, you got heaps of ammo. Why is it? Ah, do It's my artillery crew. <laughs> That's why, it's like. Oh, man, I didn't see that. Thank you. Right, let's clean this stuff up. Where are you? There, okay. You got ammo? Oh, funny two. Alright, get him in as well. Man, I've lost so much of my army. Ah, damn. Get one of that in and put it on that range guy. Please. This guy. Oh, he did charge us anyway. Okay, 
Okay. And this dude's gonna be out of ammo in a second. Still got two units of Croxies yet. Right, get out of here, Doom Milk. You artillery are next to useless. Smash on this one. Yeah, Trichy, you can take him right. Just gotta watch those croxies. Because really, what's gonna kill us? I think those croxy oars. Right, everybody on this lord. Whatever he happens to be. Let's see if we can rout it out. Oh man, I can't believe how much damage we took. I'm so glad those croxies are not getting involved. So we're going to be in so much trouble. God damn artillery, stop firing please. No real point you're firing now guys. Hold on to that. So we've got one summon in as well. God, here they come. We're so close to dead too. Alright, get these guys on those croxies. You got ammo? No, that would have been handy. Right, the Lord died. Okay. All the stuff back in. Trich is going to carry us here again. I knew it was going to be a hard fight, but I didn't really expect it to be that hard, honestly. Like, this has almost wiped my army out hard, right? And it kind of means we need to stay here and regenerate and recruit and stuff for ages. He's going to kill all that. Okay, we can just fast forward that. Wow. I can't believe we almost lost. That's not a good victory at all. I mean, it takes out the um, Lizardmen's main centre, but it's jeepers, creepers. We've got 101 dudes left. Wow. Yeah, and Tretchy in there at full health. Good work, boy. As a tank, that's for sure. She doesn't do a lot of damage, eh? That sucked. So I have to go to loot and occupy this, I think. See what kind of recruiting buildings we get. Hopefully, get something decent. We can just straight recruit back into this. Croxy's actually got a lot of kills, considering they didn't really get involved until near the end. Maybe one of the units was already in there because that one's dead, obviously. Yeah, there's a lot of units across the board for them, except for their range stuff, which is not surprising. 115 on that big dude, too. Decent garrison. Oh, I lost so much stuff. Oh, oh. You're right. Alright, I want to see what we got building wise. Nothing. Uh, we have nothing left, basically. Okay. 
Man, it takes so long to re-recruit this stuff. Uh, I'm going to grab one of these this time. It's six turns just to get that stuff. Man. Mm-hmm. I'll grab that, grab that. Um, he's gonna be so weak. So weak. That makes us vulnerable up here. He's already moved, eh? Everybody else has already moved, I think. Uh, yep. Man, it's going to take us so long to get back up to, like, fighting standards, right? Man, that sucked. I mean, it's going to be took their, their main town and stuff, but, Lord. Right? <laughs> that sucks so bad. Okay. Oh well. We took it. It's done. Let's deal with it. Deal with the aftermath. I say it's just gonna the Warriors of Chaos were still around, so okay, fine. Uh, it's gonna take us a wee while to obviously get that army back up running to full speed. Uh obviously we'll join our allies, thanks. The Wood Elves with the oh, I'll get the Athel Lauren, I suppose. I don't know what they've got left in there. I guess all the other Wood Elves are alive in there as well. Yeah. This dude's going to run amok now because I can't really obviously pull my army back to stop him. Hmm. It's not going to be good. Well, you guys need to actually do something, man. You haven't done anything for ages. Literally, you just did nothing. Okay, thanks. That's helpful, right? Thanks, boys. You buggers. Right, boys, I think that's where we're going to wrap this one up. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Now, remember, if you did, to hit that like button. If you did not like the episode, hit that dislike button. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. I totally said thanks for watching like 20 times. That's ridiculous. Goodbye.